right in the middle of Kitgum district of Uganda. I traveled to capture an outstanding story resulting from a community-led youth effort to advocate for extension of community education to Pagwa village in Kitgum Matidi Town Council. Using a motorbike, it took me about 30 minutes to ride from Kitgum town to Pagwa village. Using Guruki Debo Highway, Pagwa village is two kilometers off Matidi town. Um, we are Fach Enoch. I work as a area coordinator, Kitugum and Lamo districts. Uh, here, this is Pagua Nursery Primary School. Uh, this school started as a result of a group which we are working with in this area called the Pagua Shamba Youth uh, Group. Uh, in their advocacy, they realized that they don't have a school in this area. The children were walking uh, quite a far distance to access the school. Now, why we start this school is for these regions. We are very far from other schools. Neighboring school from here is two to three kilometers. So the reason why we start is one is two to try to bring up the, this children, this, they cannot go to, 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 to the other school. Secondly, last time we, we had lost two children road accident when they were going to school there. So we thought that to reduce that accident, we start our own school. This is very near here. So they decided to come together, mobilize the communities. They sold their idea to the communities and the community bought the idea. They had the discussions, they had the dialogues, we supported them, they invited the district stakeholders, the sub-county stakeholders, and even the village stakeholders. So they came, they started the building this school. They have so far come up with three classrooms. As you can see, they are grass thatched. But because there is a need and there is demand, there are already about 50 pupils who are already registered in this school. They are studying. The only challenge they tell us is that they have one teacher and the resources to pay the teacher they have not yet tried to secure. Even the resources that they use like plastic materials, the children are sitting down. They don't have chairs, they don't have blackboards, but the children are coming. The parents have done their part they have put up the structures and they are still calling on other stakeholders. If there is any help that can be given to them, they will be very grateful to continue with the school. My name is Sokot Alex. I am a, a teacher of Pagua Nursery and Primary School. This school started this term too on the 10th June 2024 with eight pupils. Right now, I registered 58 people. Now I am now facing a lot of challenges. I don't have chairs, table, scholastic materials for running a school. One year jar can have one with two people school and again more work in Yabo. What year now for the kid and what end my kid and school my kid with the kid wanted school level. Before my family me work me carry a pair of my own and go to school. Then my mama long my pull pair. Lego ruban go make a gum. Back what he matter. But what get to catch him matter do my do. For you back.